Hey, okay, I'm on the road again. Old Bubba's gonna hit the radio. Let's see what's on there. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to the Misfit Podcast with your host, Zorn. Now, in today's episode, we talk about random things like we always do. So sit back, enjoy, and here we go. The Misfit Podcast? Hey, what the hell, I'm bored anyway. So your story, tell me. Okay, so first of all, let me turn down this fucking volume. Jesus Christ, this game is loud. Uh, okay, so basically... Where's, where's hey, he's, he's a good YouTuber. Yeah, it's, I swear, I YouTube all the time. Okay, so Wait, you basically, don't? <laughs> no. I watch YouTube, there's a difference. Uh, anyway, sorry. Okay, so basically... I was at work, and... So basically you do work? There, yeah. Uh, <laughs> no, it's... At my job, we have this thing called IRDR for Amazon, which means a during Sunday now, which used to be Saturday, uh, we will have to do this thing called SOX compliance, which is means we can't talk to other counters while counting okay that's bullshit so, anyway yeah it's 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 so we don't uh no it's so we don't get like um it's so we don't fuck how can i explain this mm-hmm. uh, yeah no i'm trying i'm trying to explain basically it's so we don't know what the other person counted basically so, so trying it's to, like trying to see it, if they're doing yeah, their they job want right. Yeah, every, they want everything to be a blind count. So if they think we're talking to another person, they're thinking that we're trying to say, hey, what's in this bin so I can get the proper, you the know, proper count and, shit. you know, not yeah, get Yeah, the proper fu- count and not get, yeah, and not get fucked over. Okay. So, so we're not supposed to be talking during that time. So I think that's what made this funnier than what it should have been. Okay. So I was sitting next to my friend Ron, who is a stower. So I am allowed to talk to him. Right, but not a counter. <laughs> yeah, not a counter. But okay. um. So anyway, uh, for some reason, during uh, during my counting, I saw like this last item. I'm like, what the fuck is this? I turn it over, and it's a do. It's a like a fucking picture of a dude with a tube in his nose. And for some reason, it was the most funniest fucking thing. I'm like, holy shit, that got dark quick. And I just started laughing. Like, and what, like, we're what talking like, you know, snot, snot tube? What, what are we talking here? Like, like, you know? like a breathing respirator tube. Oh, okay, okay. So, like, a so medical I was like, thing. Holy, yeah, I'm like, holy shit, that got dark quick. And I started fucking laughing. And he's like, what the fuck's so funny? And then I showed him the fucking thing, and he started laughing. And it just continuously started getting funnier and fucking funnier for some reason. All right. And let's leave it at this. It got to the point where I was on the floor. I couldn't breathe. I was drooling and I was crying. Jesus Christ, man. It was it was that fucking funny. Like it's it's one of those you have to be there moments. But okay. f- oh my god. I'm like, okay. That was at 12:30. We didn't stop laughing until 1:30. You fucking shitting me, man. No, I'm not. So, that was <laughs> happening. Right. And then he had to go break on 145. I'm like, okay. Because he had to change floors as well. So, he went to fourth floor while I was still on second. So, I'm like, okay. It's one. It's 150. I'm calm. I'm relaxed. I'm no longer thinking about that dumbass thing. 153 rolls around. Uh-oh. <laughs> guess what guess what happens to be in the goddamn bin I had a count <laughs> the one thing that, again it was, it was that fucking medical thing and I just fucking lost my shit I'm like fuck this so I went and I told my uh my PA I'm like dude I gotta go home I'm, I'm fucking losing my shit Right now at the station, I can't fucking breathe. I'm lightheaded. 
He's like, what time are you going home? I'm like, 2.30, dude. I can't fucking do this shit right now. Because I swear to God, if that thing fucking comes by again, I'm not going to do work. I'm just, I'm just, I'm just done. He's like, all right. So I left it. <laughs> fucking, I left it 2.30. <laughs> okay, now I have to ask, were you drunk at any point during this? Because it sounds an awful light l- lot like you were drunk. <laughs> no, it was, it like, it, it just, like, it was just out of the fucking blue. That's what made it fucking hilarious. Really? Huh. Yeah. I mean, I could understand if it was, like, you know, some type of, uh... Like a, like, you know, a sex toy, but, you know, it... it no, A, a breathing no, respirator made you laugh your ass off, huh? No, because, like, I turned it around, I was like, what the fuck is this? And then what I saw is what fucking made it hilarious. Because he was, like, so fucking happy... And then, like, you see his wife, like, right behind him. It's like she's about oh, okay. to fucking rip the tube out of his goddamn, like... Oh, like, like, she, like she's sitting there with a paddle going, like, I'm going to take this out. This is stupid. Why the fuck are you wearing this? No, so... It, like, it was, like, uh, it was like a mask that you wore around your head. Oh, God. Yeah, so it was, like, it goes around, like, it goes to your nose, it goes around... And then it has like a strap for the top of your head, and then at the top there's a hose that you can stick the uh, tube into. But it was like a big ass hose, like a fucking vacuum cleaner sized hose. Oh god, we're talking like which old, I think we're talking yeah, like old which, war, old World War Two like gas mask kind of hose almost. Yeah, it was that type of hose. Oh god. So yeah. <laughs> so there's that, and then his wife looked like so happy. She's like, yeah. But like in my I'd mind, I'm like, with she's that. gonna fucking pull. She's gonna fucking pull that shit out. <laughs> He's gonna fucking die on the goddamn floor. Oh god! And then it was like it was just funny for no fucking reason. Like people that were around us heard us laughing. Like, oh, fuck! What was that one time where we were laughing so fucking hard I couldn't breathe? Oh! It was it was that type of laughter. Oh god, we did we did something. I forget what that was, but yeah, I remember that where you were just like, I can't breathe, man. I can't fucking breathe. Yeah, I was, I was, I, I pulled a wildcat. I started wheezing out of nowhere. <laughs> yeah, I like, remember that. Oh god, no. It was that's how that's how my day at work went. <laughs> Saw some dumb shit that I shouldn't have laughed about, and yet you laughed your ass off. Yet I laughed about it for a full hour straight. <laughs> nice. Yeah, better than my day. I get to work and five people are fucking missing. And it sounds like my job. <laughs> yeah, but when we when we have only a I mean we only have a certain amount of crew, it uh it wears on you real quick. Yeah. And the fact that the person that was supposed to be there yesterday was not there and I had to take care of his mess so that, you know, he looked good and shit like that. It's like, you gotta be fucking shitting me. So to put it in retrospective, um, I have to drive uh, school buses. I bought a magic school bus. Yeah, basically, Sorry. except instead of taking, you know, you know, kids to school, I'm taking the piglets to the whorehouse to learn how to be whores, basically. Nice. Yeah, I'm, 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 the, whore, I'm the whore bus man. Um, but that's beside the point. Um, <laughs> I'm driving the bitches <laughs> Like, drive your right, ladies, we're going to horse school. Let's Exa- go. Exactly. I'm going to take you to horse school. I'll pick you up when you when you turn 18, basically. Oh, that's getting cut. Um, <laughs> No, that's staying in. It's a podcast. Shut up. Yeah, who knows. But it was just one of those where he didn't take care of any of the deads from yesterday or anything. And we're mm. talking about, you know, a 600-pound sow that died of, you know, natural causes, unfortunately. No. Y- you know, from just being old and stuff. Yeah. And she's been sitting out in 90 degree weather for a full day and then another uh, half day on top of that. Uh, uh. <laughs> yeah, and there was two of them and I had to pick them up with a tractor, but they don't fit in the bucket. So I literally have to get down off the tractor, get a so chain nice. un- under them, and they're rotting, basically. They're turning bluish. It really is disgusting. They're literally turning bluish. I have to... Wedge the chain under them and the dirt, you know, do a slip knot, get them up behind the front legs, and then lift with the tractor, hoping to God that they literally do not blow up in front of me. Uh. 
that was my day at the end of the day today, so I would have rather have seen that fucking respirator thing. Dude, if, I would fucking find it for you. I swear to God, I will. But I mean, right you now, work at you work at the Fortnite. Amazon, so you should know how to find it. Uh, well, no, I, no, I mean, I mean on the actual physical website. Oh, I see, I see, I see. Yeah, yeah, do that when you can. Yeah, I, I gotta defend the weather balloon real quick. I'm just gotta. Oh, you playing Fortnite again? Yeah. How are you? I mean, how, I've I've played with you a little bit, and you seem to be enjoying it. How are you enjoying it without you know, playing with other people? Is it a little harder or? No, it's. No, it's fun. Yeah, it's it's they got a good matchmaking system where it's like, yeah, we're gonna just throw you in in a lobby if you're here, and you know you can be the, between these levels. Yeah. You know, it's, it's... No, I've been, no, I've been stuck with some high level people. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. But you know, it's like high for that area. Like if they were trying to yeah. go to the next area, it'd be really bad for them. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. So it, I'm really enjoying the game. I just. I wish I could record it, but my computer, for st and I'm not the only one who's been having that problem. It's like, unless you have a high-end computer, like, way, way high-end, or, you know, are not using OBS, OBS just does not seem to like, um, that game at all. Uh, fuck. I am, I guess I can build a house around me so I can tell you what the fuck that, it's called, Fraps? it was something, I was watching, no, not Fraps, um, but it does start with an F. Uh, I'll tell you in a second. Let me just get to the top of this tower. Oh, yay! Building materials. Something I can't fucking use. Oh, did I tell you? I got fucking black people, finally. Oh, yeah, I saw that. How do you feel? I feel better. <laughs> <laughs> you fucking black people. Oh, my Christ. It fucking took forever, but... You, you, uh, done, you done playing the, uh, the Mexican lady there, Ramirez? Yeah, now I'm just playing a black lady. I was a black guy at one point. Why? Why? Why are we playing like chicks in that game? Like seriously, I. It's one thing I've always wanted to ask. Like it's like why? He was, he was constructor. He was a constructor. I'm not good with constructors. Ah, unlike me, who basically mains a constructor. Yeah, she's a. The chick I'm playing right now is a soldier. So. I ah, that. so you got the black female soldier. I see. Yeah. Oh my god, I showed my friends the great Dolomite. Holy shit. Yeah, there was that whole oh, thing Oh, the, do the Dolomite thing? You didn't yeah, I showed him... I, sh I basically sat there and quoted, It's the great Dolomite to him. It's the great Dolomite, Ch Charlie Black? Or Chucky well, Black? Uh, Charlie Brown. Oh god. Yeah, I showed what? him that shit while he was on break. So he was sitting next to me while I was counting. Oh. And I was fucking quoting that shit. And then during lunchtime, I showed him. Fucking lost his shit. He couldn't fucking breathe. I remember when you showed me that shit. It was just one of those where it's like, this is my life now. I have officially seen this and can never go back to being the normal person I was, even though I was. Filmora, you know, that's what it's called. What is it? Filmora. Filmora, that's her? No, that, no, that's no. That's the uh, name of the. Uh, oh, Filmora, I see. Yeah, Filmora. Film or. Uh, I see. No matter, I see, said the blind man. I have, I have so many questions. You do? You do? I have so many questions with no answers. Ah, Filmora, I see. Thank you. I will have to yeah. give that a look. Yeah, it's a free download. It's only for 30 days, but... <laughs> it's only... I mean, hell, I've bought a lot of shit that, uh, recently. I mean, I've got... i got video capture so software that I basically I bought for, like, 30 bucks. Where I can basically pull any u video off of YouTube, and yeah. get get the actual video or like the uh, MP4 data from it. The audio. Yeah. What in the? What in the? What I, is that? I have that. I have that <laughs> quote actually. Perfect. Um, oh no, the balloon's landing. Shit. <laughs> Fuck. Shit. Did Stack. You sh did you shoot it down this time or no? No, I didn't shoot it down. I was no. It's touching down in a minute. How the fuck are you guys losing so much goddamn health? I don't know. I'm not in the game. How the hell should I know? Oh, they're protecting survivors. Okay. Still, how the fuck are you guys losing health? Are they low level, perchance? No, they're higher level than me. Are they? Only using, difference is are they using I have melee? a higher energy level. Are they using melee? 
constructor soldier and a uh, vanguard. Whatever the fuck they are, the people that s scavengers. I'm just gonna call them scavengers. Oh, outlanders. Yeah. Yeah, those people. Yeah. It, it was a treasure chest. I'm like, uh, sure. Yeah. No, I really, uh, I actually really enjoy that game, and you know, can't wait for, um, you know, to play it more. I just. Wish I could record it. Um, the other thing, um, I'm actually putting a video out right now as we speak, kind of deal, where mm -hmm. where I'm explaining, you know, I'm going to be putting out five videos a week. Yahoo, you know, I'm going to die lately. A video within a video. A video within a video. Hey, Inception. Um, but basically, it's one of those where shit, 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 shit. Sorry. <laughs> it's all right. You're fine. Um, it's just one of those where I have been, you know. You know, getting more experienced on camera, and it's just like I, I can do this now. You know, it's it's a lot easier for me to talk. Uh, mm -hmm. It's it's still frustrating as all hell sometimes, especially when I'm trying something new. But I've just learned to like say, you know what, fuck it, I'm trying this and I'm going with it. Um, but yeah, so going back to the five video thing, I have no idea how the hell I'm gonna do this. In all honesty, it, it's it's yeah. it's just. One of those where it's like, yeah, I can do it, but it's like my social life is going to go to hell even more. Yeah. Yeah, and I got to figure out like what games to play, you know. Yeah. That's that's the big thing, and I'd like to be able to play like you know Minecraft with you. S speaking of that, Sky fucking Factory, man. Oh. You know. Holy shit, dude! Like, in all honesty. I am addicted to that game. I literally spent all this weekend, all this weekend from 8 o'clock in the morning on Saturday to 12 o'clock in the morning on Sunday playing Jesus playing fuck. that game. And then Sunday, I didn't go to bed till fucking 3 o'clock this morning. And I had to be up at 5. I literally sat there eating bread and cheese all fucking day and drinking water to just play Minecraft. Oh, God, that thing's fucking... I... Noise. Yeah, I mean, at least I got up to eat on, like, some of those WoW players. Yeah. But it was just like, by the end of it, it's like, yeah, I did everything I wanted. I wasted a whole bunch of my fucking life. I can never exactly. get that back. And I didn't even fucking record it. Oh, Jesus. It's like, son of a bitch. You know? Yeah. I mean, luck and the other thing is, luckily, I did take a fucking shower, because if I don't take two showers a day, man... You I smell like pig ass. Well, besides that, I just feel nasty. Like, I can feel, like, the grime, like, growing you, on my skin. You, you feel the stank. I, I, I feel the sweat, the stank, and everything. It's just like, yeah, I feel my, I feel, I feel the odors. And, you know, I'm not one to say, you know, you know, oh, I'm a germaphobe. It's like, but I like to be clean, at least, a little bit. Yeah. You know, so, it was just one of those where it's like, I just feel icky, so I, I got up and just left the thing running to um to get some stuff. Yeah. Holy hell man, that is a that is a hard game and if you see my operation from you know what you start from i swear to god I think, oh, shit. I, I think I've put over fifty hours into that thing already. Jesus. And I just started that last week, kind of, you know, like two weeks ago. I have totally gone over the deep end of that game but the thing is I like I want to play it with you guys yeah. but I don't know if the realms thing works like that you know you know supposedly it does because they say like hey you can do you know you know can do this like sky thing and you know in realms but it's like is that true how do I do that then you know do I need to run it or what's going on you know do I need to install it yeah you know because I'm using the twitch thing so who knows and it's just one of those where I would like to... I'm curious, so I should probably look it up in all honesty. Yeah. Um, but yeah, so that that is uh, something I'm definitely looking into because I think me and you, at least, if not more people, could do a whole lot of shit in there. Like, have, um, have you ever like, heard... I, like I used to fuck with Tinker Construct, so... Oh, dude, I am well beyond that. I'm a, I'm into environmental crafting. I'm in... I'm into, um... Uh, mystical agricultural stuff. I created mob spawners. I'm, uh, have you heard of a thing called the Beneath? 
Okay, sorry, there was an explosion. The what? <laughs> Have you heard of a thing called the Beneath? The Beneath? The Beneath. Beneath? Yeah, like, it's beyond, it's beyond, like, the nether kind of deal. No. Well, basically, to craft it, you need, um, four withered, um, withered Skeletons. Eye of Enders. No, four withered Eye of Enders. You need, um, what do you want to call it? Four quadruple compressed cobblestone. Quadruple compressed? Yes, quadruple compressed. And then you need one quintuple compressed cobblestone, which is like 6,000 and some, plus the plus the four um, quadruple compressed, which are at least like 700 and stuff. Um, luckily, I had like three cobblestone generators going, but it's like, my fucking god. <laughs> Yeah. And then there's like power and everything you gotta do. It's like holy shit. It's, it's just a. It, just, it's just it, a charade of emotions. It's that, a charade <laughs> of emotions, and it's like I need power here. I need power here. Okay, beginning game. You can do Sterling generators real easy to power stuff, mm -hmm. but you need lava in order to do that to power them. Yeah. And you can pipe it from those uh, crucibles, which are really easy to make in, in the long run. Yeah. But you, you know, it's just, it's one of those where you have to do this to do that, to do this. And it's just like it all intertwined. It's like, holy shit. And there's never just one way to do something either. You can yeah. like use stuff from like, oh, I'm going to use mystical agriculture here to create this block. Or I'm going to use, you know, this essence and stuff. And then you, you know, you just automate everything at, you know, some point with what you can. Um, if you ever go watch a guy called XB Crafted. Holy shit, man! That that is some uh, that is some very interesting, interesting stuff. Uh, so yeah, now the question becomes, you know, how to set that up. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. So, um, anything anything in the news you want to talk about or anything um, kind of deal, or you haven't been really paying attention other than your story since I've you know gabbed my brains out about what I want to do. Right. Probably buy this fucking screen capture thing. Oh, you know, I can just. Oh, so you can finally put start posting videos? Yeah, because my friends keep telling me like, yeah, why don't you post videos? Cause fucking time to do such. You're telling me I'm about ready to start posting fucking five five videos a week. <laughs> that's no, that's your own goddamn problem. <laughs> you thought about it. Yeah, I thought about it and I realized, hey, I can do it. I have to give up basically all my free time, but it's well, it's there was. <laughs> yeah exactly. But it's like I want to do it because it it just to me it feels right. You know what I mean? Yeah. And so I just got to figure out like, hey, you know, it's I can do this. I just have to figure out how. You know, I just I'm I, I would say I'm a well-rounded person. In a lot of aspects of life, wouldn't you agree? Yeah. Like I know a lot. I know a lot about things, but I'm not like as proficient as one can get in certain things, like drawing. You know, I was I was decent at it. You know, I had my moments where it was great, and I had my moments where I sucked ass. Yeah. Um, I just kind of fell into the spell. It's like in those moments I sucked ass, I didn't really see the good, and it's like, well, I don't want to draw anymore. Um, yeah. You know. I got jealous of people when I shouldn't have and stuff like that. And it's like, YouTube, I can do whatever the hell I want. Yeah. And so that's where I feel like mostly like, oh, this this is fun. I'm, I'm enjoying myself. You know, like right now, hell, we're recording something just for the shits and giggles of it. And I may, you know, put this to like a farming simulator thing, you know, or, some, or you know, like a, like, you know, hey, this is Bubba on, you know, on the air with, with, um, uh, so, with, with with trucking <laughs> with <simulator>. Leroy, <laughs> Leroy <laughs> Jenkins, and you know it might become a regular thing where I just play a game or something, and we do like this. To, uh, you know, we and you just do this talking behind it. You know, yeah, um, kind of deal. So who knows uh, what? Yeah, four chest. <laughs> but you know, who knows what I'll do with it? Again, it's just one of those where I wanted to try this kind of deal. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, and see how it goes drunk podcasts drunk po oh i would love to do that except the problem becomes it's a weekday for me i don't want to get that drunk yeah 
I mean, I can have, uh, you know, the other thing is I can only have, like, a couple of beers or a couple of shots and I'll be fine. Yeah. You know, I just have to pick a day where, like, tomorrow I have to go in at 3 fucking 30 in the morning. Jesus. Yeah, so, there, there is that. You know, welcome, welcome to my life. Yeah. Trust me, everyone's like, why don't you get, well, keep telling me, why don't you go to day shift? Because I don't want to wake up at 4 o'clock in the fucking morning, that's why. Yeah. Yeah, pretty much. And then you what you lose like what a couple bucks an hour because of that too. I will lo- I will literally lose. Uh, if you do nights, you get fifty cents. If you do weekends, which I'm doing, you also get fifty cents. And I was like, yeah, there's open for donut days. Why don't you go to that? Fuck that. What's... I just got up to fifteen dollars. Why the fuck would I go back to fourteen? What's donut days? Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, Friday. Oh, I see. Monday, Tuesday, Monday, so I would get, Monday through Wednesday, so get, and then. So basically, I would get Sunday, Wednesday, and Saturday off. Sunday, Saturday. Okay, I see that. I see that. That ain't bad. Three days off. Well, you already have that anyway, don't yeah, you? Yeah, it's it's three days off regardless of what shift you have. Damn. Yeah, uh, the only difference is which days you have off. I see. So for me, since I work. Uh, Thursday through Sunday, I have Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday off. Back half has Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. Front half has Wednesday. So they have Thursday, Friday, Saturday off. And then week, well, other weekend shift, which is Saturday through Tuesday, has Wednesday, Thursday, Friday off. Okay, I see. Whereas mine, it's, um, I work five days, get two days off. Work five days, get two days off. Work... Six. No, 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 no. Uh, five plus two plus another five. That's twelve days. I work twelve days, then get two days off. Ah. Because I have to work the weekends. Like this is my weekend to work kind of deal. Yeah. And so that's why I have to work like you know fifty-five hours a week, which pays the bills, but it's also like I'm working in a very hard job. You know what I mean? It's like very yeah. manual, like. I, I'm having bones crack where I shouldn't have bones crack in my life already. It's I, there's, there's days where I look and it's like I wake up and I just creak and groan. And it's like I shouldn't be doing this at my age. You know what I mean? Yeah. It's like there there is no way in hell, you know, if you had told me, yeah, you're going to be doing this when you're older. That I would say, oh, yeah, I'm going to be creaking my. Yeah, sure. You're you're on you're on some drugs there. You know, you've been drinking too much. But, I mean, like, I walk across the floor and you're just here. Click, 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 click. It's like, what the hell is that? It's like, that's my ankles. I cannot control that. Yeah. It's it's so bad. I mean, don't get me wrong. I've got some great muscle underneath all the padding I have. Yeah. But it's it's just very hard work. And then on top of that, I'm trying to do this YouTube thing, going back to my five days thing. So it's like, when do I have time to fucking cook or anything? And now we bring you to the point of the podcast where we are sponsored by Blue Apron. Just kidding. Hashtag not an ad. But no, seriously, Blue Apron. Yeah, Hit seriously. Come on, come on. I can. I, I need the. I need the food. Seriously. Like I, I. Okay. I went to go. I went and bought taco fixings. All right. For for the uh, weekend, I'm like, I'm gonna make tacos. I'm gonna. Be, I'm gonna be productive. I'm gonna. You know, get all my dishes washed. I'm gonna. I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna do that. And then I sit down and play Minecraft. And literally just eat the cheese and tortillas for two <laughs> days straight. Like, literally just loaded up Mexican cheese on tortillas. Didn't even melt it. That's how lazy I was. I didn't even fucking <laughs> melt. I didn't even fucking melt it. I just literally sat there and ate cheese and bread and drank Coke and water through two days straight. Jesus Christ. Holy shit. <laughs> 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 no, sorry. I looked at vendor bucks. I got like six hundred of them. Holy Ooh, shit! Very nice, very nice. But it was just like one of those. I'm just sitting there going like, at one point I'm like, why the fuck did I make tacos? So now I've got you know I've got ground meat sitting in there that needs to be cooked up sometime this week, in order to be cooked into tacos. But I can't cook it into tacos because I wasted all the tortillas and cheese. Dude. But the good thing is, I did buy also like hamburger helper stuff. Uh, so all I need to go buy is milk, so I can do that, you know, to replace what I lost. You better get your ass carton. 
Yeah, but it's it, I don't even need a card. Um, that's I'll get into that one real quick. Um, but it's just one of those where I'm just sitting there going like, I'm a dumbass for what I'm eating right now. Like there should be I I should not be able to keep my current weight at 200 pounds with the way I've been eating if it wasn't for my job. Like literally today I had two packets of oatmeal. Mm -hmm. Ooh, that sounds was, good. It, uh, no. apple, apples and cinnamon, man. Greatest fucking, greatest fucking oatmeal ever. That's, that's all right. That's my that's my personal favorite. All right. All right. Anyway, um, but then after that, I didn't eat lunch because I had so much work today because of the five people gone. I just you know kind of just sat there and drank water. Yeah. Um, and then went went and did my job and then after work i literally sat i literally on the way home stopped at arby's got a small small roast beast for um uh what do you want to call it uh uh mozzarella sticks and a large pepsi i like mozzarella sticks <laughs> cheesy sticks yeah they're the great stuff but that's like that's all i have eaten today i don't know how the hell i'm still functioning because that's not... I don't even think that's 2,000 calories. You know what I mean? E even even with the, the Arby's meal, you know, if you, if you figure that's over 1,000 calories, the oatmeal alone is not 1,000. Yeah. Well, and you it, said you had, like, fucking... No, I think you're including the mozzarella sticks. Never mind. False line. I, I include the mozzarella sticks, the large Pepsi, and, and, the, and the sandwich. Hmm. I've literally had less than 2,000 calories a day today, and everything else has been water or oatmeal. How the hell am I still functioning and don't look like a fucking stick? I don't know. I rarely eat. Literally, majority of my uh, day is consisted of me not eating anything. It's usually just, like, water. Yeah. It's, form of liquid. It's just, it was just one of those where I'm sitting there going, what the fuck am I doing? You know what I mean? Something. Yeah. What was I gonna say? Um, oh, guess who retweeted me? Uh. After I tweeted them, because I wanted to go, I wanted to go buy his book. Do you know who I'm talking uh, about? Nope, not a single clue. Man, you have not been watching shit, have you, lately on the Achievement Hunter? No. Thing? No, I don't. I literally no. Uh -huh. I don't. Even, I mean, dude, I fucking just watch whatever I want. At the time, it's like, does this look interesting? Sure, I'll watch it. All right, and all right, fair enough. Don't watch anything. Fair enough. Anyway, um, Jeremy Dooley wrote a book called Go Nitro, that he's Jeremy. Been... Yeah, <laughs> J Doos. Um, but I I went to go buy his book and it was out of print. And it's like, wait a minute, it, he just released it last week. How the hell is it out? You know, you know, out, out already. And I'm, I mean, even you know, factoring in all the Rooster Teeth fans, they can just print more, basically. You know what I mean? Yeah. And so I, I, I said, hey, you know, I took a screenshot and said, hey, I went to go buy your book, and, you know, it, it, I can't buy it. You know, like, w what's going on? He retweeted me saying, sorry, there's an error. They're fixing something in the book. You know, it'll be available later. But at that point, it's just like, holy shit, one of them answered me. Don't fuck. Well, you were, well, it's concerning something that you wrote, he's like, cause you know, he, he's, he's, he, I think he, out of all of them, he actually replies back to fans more because, you know, yeah, he, he started he as a fan in of himself. Yeah, he was a community member. Did you see the day he got, him and Matt Bragg got hired that same day at yeah, RTX? Uh, yeah, like, can we work? And I'm, I'm Axial Matt. <laughs> <laughs> and, I, and I'm, and I'm... <laughs> Hold on, me and is home. Okay. Let's real quick. All right. And now, a word from our sponsor. Hey to all you truckers out there. While driving all day long, do you ever get that trucking backup? You know we aren't talking about traffic. Well, have we got the solution for you. Easy Pass, the only laxative for truckers. Using an extra strong mix of caffeine and grease, Easy Pass will unclog anything you have brewing down there. So instead of spending 20 minutes of moaning and groaning, just reach for your Easy Pass. Easy Pass, your only co-pilot. Hey, that sounds pretty good there. Maybe I should give me some of that stuff. Alright, I wonder if this podcast is almost over. Ah, shit, I'm in the game. By the way. <laughs> Never mind, false alarm. This is my base, okay. I had a panic attack for a second. Oh, uh, I hate that. But yeah, uh, you know, it's just one of those where I was not expecting that because I've retweeted them. I've retweeted a lot of people at Rooster Teeth about a lot of things that they were talking about. 
like um, Gavin Free was uh, a couple what was it a couple days ago talking about like uh, a video he saw like hunting and stuff like that mm -hmm. and um, being a person that you know hunts for meat and stuff like that it was one of those where I you know I just like I wanted to explain to him you know why this guy was elated I mean other than the fact that you know you sit there for numerous hours it's like you know you've I mean, yes, you're taking, you know, the life of an animal. I get that. I feel whenever I do, I am very, you know, grateful and thankful for the animal sacrifices so that I may, you know, um, you know, live kind of deal. Yeah. You know, it, it, you know, I never take for granted, like, yes, I can do this. And, it, you know, it's always I sit there and I always say a prayer and everything. But, you know, at the end of the day, I'm going to eat that. You know, I don't I don't try to let anything go to waste. I mean... Other than the guts, really, and and the bones, um, I I take everything from that. But yeah, other than that, it's just one of those where it was it was amazing that he retweeted me. Going back to my original statement, so I think that's a good time to to uh, end this, don't you? Yeah, because my, my mom had my mom had a shitty day at work. Oh, she, and now she wants she corn nuts. In, what the hell is she, you? I have she to... came in pissed. Oh, so I see. So I, I cracked open a blue moon and gave it to her. Oh, it's one of those days on a yeah, Monday. Yeah, one of those days. Ooh, I see. Well, especially seeing how they moved into a new building. Oof. Twenty years. Twenty. To get shit straight, and they fucked up. <laughs> <laughs> Nice. I got a, I got a new boss, but that's a whole another story we'll go into. But you know, for right now, I think that's where we're gonna end it. So, Kendall, you know, thank you for joining me, and you know, all you to all you me. folks. I'm always here. Yeah, I know. <laughs> <laughs> and to all you folks out there, I hope you guys enjoyed the show. Yeah, that was pretty decent. I may listen again. Who knows? But hey, well, Bubba's gonna take a nap now. Old bones and everything.